Now this morning, a Connecticut man is behind bars after fire officials say he was targeting ambulances by throwing bomb like devices at them, which eventually started fires. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Christian Cologne is live at our B studio with the latest on this investigation. Christian. Yeah, good morning. Police were on the hunt for 37 year old Richard White of Torrington. Officials in Old Saybrook say he is the sole suspect in the arson fire at the Hunter's Ambulance Facility in Old Saybrook yesterday. This all started after White allegedly threw a Molotov cocktail at it, and this wasn't the only place he targeted. Emergency medical service agencies in Connecticut on high alert after a man was allegedly targeting them with bomb-like devices. Police spent several hours looking for Richard White, who ended up fleeing to Pennsylvania, which is where he was caught. We got the call about 5.45 for an automatic alarm at the firehouse. Chief Todd Wheeler with the Roxbury Fire Department says the smoke caused the ambulance bay to fill up. Eventually, they found out someone was targeting them. Luckily, Chief says no one was inside. No injuries have been reported, but the Roxbury Fire Department was not the only crime scene. Richard White was caught last night and is facing arson and burglary in the second degree. He is expected to be extradited and has a court set bond at a $150,000. Coming up, how fire officials were balancing putting fires out while being a target. Christian Cologne, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.